Asia Pacific markets are trading mixed today as China's factory activity falls into contraction territory for the first time since April. The purchasing managers index in July comes in at 49.2, missing economists' expectations of 50.3. This follows official data showing China's factory activity remaining in contraction territory for a fourth straight month. In Hong Kong then, the Hang Seng Index is up, but mainland Chinese markets are experiencing losses with the Shanghai Composite down marginally and the Shenzhen Component down as well. In Australia, stocks climbed ahead of the Reserve Bank of Australia's rate decision. Economists are expecting a 25 basis point hike in its benchmark policy rate to 4.35%. In Japan, stocks rise as the country's unemployment rate slightly falls to 2.5% in June, while South Korea's cost pay advances around 1%, leading gains in Asia. Meanwhile, Brent crude is trading at $85 a barrel, reaching a three-month high due to signs of tightening global supply and rising demand for the rest of this year. Gold is nearing the crucial $2,000 per ounce, dollar per ounce resistance, on track for its best month in four boosted by an overall weaker dollar and expectations of major global central banks nearing a peak with interest rate hikes, which positively impacts investor sentiment. However, cryptocurrencies are trading in the deep red territory today with Bitcoin close to $29,000 and Ethereum trading at around $1,800. Moving on then, China.